how do we know Adam and Eve existed? They existed. Uh, the evidence we have that they existed is you and me. In other words, humanity. All of us have tiny chromosome in our body called mitochondrial chromosome. And we only get it from our mother. It's not passed on from the father. So it's acknowledged by all geneticists that everybody on this planet got their mitochondrial chromosomes uh, from a single woman. And they call her mitochondrial, mitochondrial Eve. She is what the Bible says. She is the mother of us all. All men have Y chromosomes, which they receive from their fathers. All the male, all male humanity uh, traces back to a single man, and evolutionists call him Y chromosome Adam. He has all the attributes of the Adam we know and believe. There is evidence that both these, at, both this Adam and Eve lived recently. It was commonly assumed that mitochondrial Adam and Eve didn't live in the same time period. They lived. Uh, it, it was commonly said they lived 100,000 years apart, or there was a 100,000-year gap between them. However, in an article I will leave below, now geneticists and scientists are saying that it's now acknowledged that this mitochondrial uh, Adam and Eve lived in the same time period. So there is evidence for uh, the Adam and Eve being the ancestors of all of humanity or the parents of all humanity in the Judeo-Christian, uh, you know, Adam and Eve, uh, there is evidence for us to believe in the Adam and Eve story.